G'day punters, welcome to another, well this is a do it yourself stuff. Got a couple of old jerry cans lying around. Decades old, so I'm gonna change it from that to this. What is it? It's a little storage locker. Good, eh? For your Matrix and uh, AOR people. Front jerry can holders in the front of your caravan. Pretty cool, eh? Video's all about how I got here. What I started off with is the jerry can in the front there. On the uh, jerry can holder. And I marked a couple of little lines in. Particularly around the back here, the lower point. And you'll see lines already. Here's the original lines for the bracket. And I've come up a little bit. And then I've picked a spot below this corner. It's about a centimetre, I suppose. I thought, that's a good spot to aim for, and draw a line across. Transcribed, transcribed it across for a right angle. Carried it across. And cut up with an angle grinder. Let's have a look and see what I do. Now that I've got the jerry can all cut up, I want to try and retard some of the um, potential rust that may occur around the cut. So I've just got some of this kill rust, matte black, and I'm just going to treat up the edges both inside and out, both top and bottom, before I go ahead and stick uh, the P seal on, or the pinch weld. Now you can see I've taped up the outside in here, and I've uh, painted on the inside and the top edge as well so I'm just going around the outside at the moment then uh, once I finish that I'll pull that tape off there you go that's the top part and the bottom part the same let them dry give them a couple of hours probably should leave them a day that's set properly then I'll put the um, pinch weld on for my purposes I've got two types of pinch weld here one with a balloon at the top I think it's about five or six mil. Stick that on the bottom part of the um, jerry can holder, and then I've got a solid one at the top. I'll show you how I install that following. So, putting pinch weld on, what I've done is because the inside of these jerry cans has this little ridge here, I've just trimmed a little cut on the inside of the pinch weld just so I get that in. As I mentioned earlier, this is um, the balloon type pinch weld on top here, or on the bottom here. Just go around with a little rubber mallet, just give it a tap all the way around to make sure that pinch weld's um, seated. Don't bang it too hard, otherwise you'll um, bust the seal on it. Well, I've got to this stage now, I've cut the jerry can. I've put the piece seal, as I say, on the bottom. And I've got that solid one up the top. The clasps I'm using are, like from a marine chandler, they're spring loaded. So that's the hook. And that's the um, actual clasp. It's actually, you can see that top part go in and out. That's in, that's out. Hinges, pretty just basic sort of stuff, stainless steel, again from the Marine Chandler. We'll finish product. I ended up using rivets, um, not the countersunk stainless steel bolts that I had. But it's worked out all right. Show you these um, clasps. Turn it the right way. See what pulled down. And that just clips back down. And this side as well. See it coming down. I've drilled some holes in the bottom for drainage. 